All right, hey everyone, this is a video on how to make announcement videos. Um, I've done one in the past that kind of showed you what we do, um, but this video is more of how we do it. So um, this is dealing with iMovie. If you have a iPhone or a Mac, um, this is what you would use. And, um, and so I'm gonna kind of go through the specifics of it real quick and uh, try to help you. Uh, first off, Basically, our announcement video, I just finished the one for this next week, um, is a minute and 45 seconds. Um, as I mentioned uh, before in, uh, in our other announcement video, basically what we do is we show the face um, on the beginning and the end, um, but so the person that's doing our announcement video uh, doesn't have to sit there and, and, and remember the whole bulletin or try to remember announcements. Um, we usually use our slides for that announcement to cover up. So if you look right here, um, she's wearing a different outfit, but it's still the same announcement. And uh, so that's pretty cool. If you can get the audio set pretty good, it's a it's a pretty cool thing. And uh, I'll show you this video uh, at the end, the final product. But this is about how to make it. And so basically, here's what I did. Uh, Jupiter Smile is an audio file from a royalty-free YouTube channel. Um, you can just go to YouTube or, or actually go to Google. Don't go to YouTube. Uh, but you're going to go to Google and type in YouTube royalty free music. And uh, when you type in royalty free, um, there's one that out there that has a lot of uh, good ones that you can look through and download them. And you don't have to worry about it getting flagged on Facebook or YouTube or anything like that. So anyways, I download this and I have it turned up to about 56% at the beginning. And, uh, and then... Uh, I drop it down to 6% while she's talking. Um, here is just a motion background. And what I did was I overlaid our graphic. And uh, basically I have a graphic that is a PNG file. Um, so uh, if you don't know what a PNG file is, it's basically like a JPEG, a regular picture, but it has no background. And, uh, and I can show you how to do that one day. But basically if you have a logo that's PNG, that means it's hollow with everything except for the actual logo. Um, and so anyways, I overlay that on top of it. And when you insert it and drag it over, it may look like this. Um, or, and it may look a little bit different. Actually that looked the same, but you can change in all these options. And so uh, this particular one, uh, since it's a PNG file, it just overlaps. Um, but uh, once you have it on there, uh, I have that playing for about four seconds, and then it goes into our welcome, and she tells us that she's so glad to see us this week, and that here are a few upcoming announcements that will be uh, going on within our church, and then we start playing our announcement slides. So it's the same thing. Uh, this little uh, logo right here that you see in the top left corner is a PNG file too. It's just a different one. And uh, so I just put it over there to kind of brand the video a little bit with our church. And then over here um, is just graphics that I've made. And, um, and basically we just cover up um, her speaking. Uh, this was late one night last week. And so um, I, I didn't use the actual video part. I just took the audio. But the reason why I recorded her on the video is so that way our audio sounds the same. Um, regardless and so I always use the video camera to record the audio for this even if I'm not using the actual video and uh, and so I just overlay it on that so anyways we go through we do all of our announcements and uh, if the song ends I repeat it and then uh, at the end um, she comes back and says thank you for watching um, you know if you need to follow us on social media there we go and then it goes to the end and then it closes out the music comes back up and then the logo, and then I have it going spinning out at the end. And uh, and so that's a, a pretty cool way to do it. Um, here at the end, I will post the video to the back end of this, so that way you can see what it looks like. And uh, it's, a, it's a pretty easy way to do it. And uh, right now with COVID, we have a lot of our announcements are kind of the same. And so that's why um, we're not having her record the whole thing over every week because it's pointless. It's the same same kind of thing. So um, anyways, if you have any questions about this, feel free to let me know and I would be glad to help. Also, if you would like and subscribe to the channel, I would appreciate it. Y'all have a great day.
everyone, welcome to First Assembly. We're so happy that you joined us today. Here are a few announcements on events that are taking place within our church. October is Pastor Appreciation Month. We want to take this time and always make a point to show our pastors appreciation for the dedication and love that they show us. They sacrifice early mornings and late nights, holidays and weekends to make sure that we are taken care of. Please feel free to give them a card or pray for them during this month. If you've been looking for a way to volunteer here at First Assembly, we're looking for nursery workers for Wednesday night service. If you would like to volunteer, please sign up in the foyer or see Pastor Brandon. If you are a young adult and you're looking to get plugged in here at First Assembly, our young adult ministry journey is meeting at our main campus on Tuesday, October 6th, beginning at 6 p.m. A meal will be provided, so invite a friend and we will see you there. Mark your calendars because our next serve day for Loving Minden is Saturday, October 24th at 8 a.m. We will meet at our main campus. If you have any questions, please see Kendall Landers. And those are the events that are taking place within our church. For more information, please pick up a bulletin, follow us on our social media accounts, or visit firstagminden.org. We hope that you have a great day and a great experience here at First Assembly.